07 Commanders, my name's Foxtrot Echo One, and I'm back. Oops, sorry. Cancel. Sorry, my my Alexa is having issues because I said Echo. All right. So anyway, <clears throat> I'm here today. We're going to talk a little bit about Elite. Maybe play a little bit. There's not much going on in the Thargoid War that I'm interested in this week, so we're going to get into that. And uh, basically, I was going to reach out, maybe talk about some things for people that are coming back to the game after a while off or starting new, some ideas. Uh, I'm not going to tell you exactly what to do because every player is different, but I'll give you some ideas that I would, that I used actually when I came back. I was gone for a long time. So let's just get into the, let's get into the, Ship here, or the carrier in the ship. Ship, ship in the carrier. How about that? Does that sound right? <clears throat> All right, my voice is a little bit not where it needs to be today. So hopefully you guys can hear everything. Um, okay, and hopefully my voice will last for a little while. We can talk about this stuff. So just to let you guys know too, if you want to support this channel. That kind of thing. I have a Patreon. I just released uh, a set. I believe it was like 58 different avatars and things. And they're all armed forces or military type. Uh, there could There's probably pilots and things like that. There is a pilot collection as well. But if you guys are interested in any of that, you know, you can sign up for as little three bucks. And uh, have some artwork for either your, you can use it on your. Anara, which we're going to talk about today, you can put it on your Discord, you can put it on your, you know, on your desktop, you can put it on all this artwork, you can put it on your home screen for your home screen if you're into that, whatever you want to do. If you don't have a kitty cat picture like I do, then you might want something else. The, the main software we're probably going to talk about today a lot, and if you're new especially, or just coming back, make sure you get onto a site called Anara. And let's go ahead and I'll just bring that over here. So you guys should be able to see that now, right? Yep. Okay, so Anara is a site that is complementary to Elite Dangerous and it shows you a lot of things. So whether you've been playing for a while or not, you may not know about this software. There's other software for other things, but this particular software is great for finding things, uh, parts, how to make money. This particular thing I'm going to talk about right now is trade routes. Um, now, you may want to do other things in the game, but one of the first things you're going to have to do is, is make some money. And there will be things, there will be, you'll, you know, you can start out and maybe you do some other uh, uh, quests and things of that nature. Each station has a bulletin board and you can go to the bulletin board and find out what's available. Can't do that here because I'm on a carrier. I don't think there is any quests there. But So what you do is you get onto Anara, you set up your profile. You can also connect this software to your um, directly to your uh, Frontier Developments account, where you have your Elite Dangerous configuration stuff. You can you can link those two together, and this software will basically download everything that you do into it, so that you can get a kind of a kind of an, over, uh, an overview of what's going on. So for example, if I go to my commander page, you can set it up. See, there's my avatar I've got. There's lots of these avatars in my Patreon, like this and different, but boys, girls, whatever you want, they're all in there. And then it kind of keeps track of all your status, all your different things you've done uh, in in your gameplay. Now you can, you can, you can add to this or uh, have to obviously my 
import needs a, a thing, but I can't do that right now. So, in any event, yeah, you you can support, you can put in other things. You can uh, tell it uh, information that's not in there. You know, otherwise you would have to if you really wanted to keep track of what you're doing. Let's say like credits and assets, and you can see like. <laughs> What happened here, you know? But uh, it actually keeps track of all your transactions. I mean, this is like keeping your bank ledger for you. Uh, it also keeps track of where you've been, what you've done, any any achievements, your transactions, your ass value of all your assets that you have when you buy uh, more than one ship or whatever. And you can just kind of go in there and find out anything you want to find out about the game. Right, so the commander one is about you, right? And like I said, if you link it, mine is linked to uh, Frontier, but every once in a while it needs to be re-connected. Uh, so, but typically it'll it'll just download your data automatically, and uh, then it'll be in there. So let me. I'm going to take this over to the other screen so I can fix this real quick. And... Approve. It's basically you put in your Frontier. Now, you, uh, you should have a Frontier account. Otherwise, you have to do it through Steam. And I'm not sure the exact process for connecting it through Steam, but it's basically the same thing. So now there's a an import game data button here, and it knows that I'm connected, and it will automatically update everything. But it, it keeps track of personal logs. Like if you want to keep a personal, like a Captain Kirk's type log or, you know, whatever, just if you just want to talk about stuff. But you can also do, like it also tells you, like when you've done things, like when I got access to these engineers, what levels, um, all the different things that I've done. Uh, and it goes back, you know, all the way, uh, as far as I know, it goes back to the beginning of time. Because I was actually using Inara before uh, I left. I had left for, you know, in a few, well, probably about, I left for about seven years is all I remember. It's six, seven years. I was gone, and when I came back, I just kind of picked up where I left off because I was still had an account, and I was still able to reconnect it to my Frontier account and uh, stuff like that. Now, I use the PC launcher, but obviously the Steam launcher is going to be more convenient for people, uh, right? The uh, version I'm playing is, is called uh, Odyssey, which is the newest expansion. You can only play it on PC, though. So, wait... Uh, Okay, let me take that back. I've heard that Xbox people can play th still through uh, their Xbox Live or whatever they call that, the Game Pass or whatever they call it. Hey, Entropy, how you doing, buddy? It's a good thing you're here because I'll probably say some wrong stuff and you can tell me what I said wrong. But uh, so we're just going over Anara a little bit here, so... Just because I think that when you play Elite, unless you just like totally get it, which I know you totally won't, you this tool is really convenient and, and good, and it has a lot of stuff. There are other tools. There's Commander's Toolbox and all these things. But I don't want to get people confused, so I'm just going to tell you about the one I know about. And you guys can come and play it. So like I was saying, if you just want to make some money for a little bit and you don't want to be too confusing, then I would say get a... Um, one of the first ships you're going to get is a Sidewinder, right? And you're going to be messing with that for a little while. And But once you get enough money to, say, buy a... What's that one called? The Mark... Let me look. Um... There's another. I still have this one. This is well, actually, it's a, there's a Mark III, but I have the Mark IV version of it. Um, where is? It? Oh, there it is. So the Cobra, Cobra Mark III, is one that you'll probably get your little hands on pretty early on, 
and you can actually that's a utility ship it does everything so you can fight in it you can do cargo in it you can do whatever in it it just doesn't do a lot so you're gonna you start out kind of slow and then work your way up but once you have some cargo space you can basically use an R to tell you what kind of missions you want to do and you can you can tell it you can and like I said if you want to do cargo which is like literally in my mind it's the easiest one I know some people are gonna come out and say oh you you can do flowers, you know, let's go scan the flowers or whatever. It's like, no, not really, because to get to the flowers, you got to go out a little ways from the bubble, and you may not be ready to do that yet. So this is what I'll tell you to do. Um, where's my... So we'll bring an R back up. So what I would do is when you first get those ships, when you get into a ship with a little bit of cargo space in it, and if you can hold out and wait till you get to like, I don't know if a crate or a python holds more. I think a python holds like 96 with a shield. So 96 cargo is not terrible. It's a medium. That's a medium size. There are other ships that hold less. I'm always like, get as big a, get as, big a cargo as you can less trips but so what you can do in Inara is you can go to uh, once you're logged in and everything you can go over to uh, trade routes it's called trade routes and it lets you the nice thing is what it does is it shows you where you are so if it's connected it'll tell you where you are it'll tell you it'll tell it'll ask you how, what's the max route distance um, that's only important depending on what kind of engineering or if you've done any upgrading to your equipment, but that's probably not going to be a thing right out of the box because you won't have any engineers open or anything like that. So, so you you know, 40 light years for a, a Mark III would be pretty far, I, mean, I think, but uh, it's not terrible. It's, it's still, but basically, you go to your <clears throat> you go to your additional options. Here. And you tell it to include round trips. So basically what Anara will give you when you tell it to search for it, it'll show you all the round trips that you can do that are easy to do. And uh, and you can just keep doing those until one of these stations runs out of stuff. So the better thing to do is to to uh, find one that's got a lot of a lot of stuff in it so supply right so your supply and your supply going one way is going to be bigger than the other and then the amount you make going one way is going to be higher than the other but it's it's a real easy thing to do and it's kind of grindy but you know if you spend if you spend a few days doing that you should have enough money to get into a bigger ship and you can keep doing that until you get into a, you know a big enough ship that you can actually work with so that was one of my things that I did when I came back. I actually was forced into that because I had I had been gone so long that my ship was no longer capable of killing anything. So I was getting killed a lot. I was down to like my last few bucks and I ended up having to sell my warship, my Corvette. And I was pretty crushed over that situation. So uh, I ended up, well, I ended up buying another. I ended up buying the largest cargo ship, which is an Imperial Cutter, which is very difficult to get. We're not going to talk about that today. But with your biggest ship, before you do any rep grinding with Empire and Federation and all that, is going to be the Anaconda. And the Anaconda is a, it's a great ship. I used to not like it. I've been converted. But the Anaconda is also very much a utility ship. You can do anything with it. You can combine things with it. A lot of ships you can really only do maybe one thing with them. And, uh, you know, like you can go, you can make them to where you can go fight and all that. But fighting makes money, but at that level, at lower levels, cargo makes more. And the bigger cargo ship you have, the more money you can make faster because you're going to end up getting into a place where 
you try to go fighting and you're going to get your butt kicked a lot. You're not going to like it. At least with cargo, there's the risk is a lot lower. I mean, you could get you could get attacked, but the risk is still way lower than if you go out bounty hunting or something like that where you have to kill somebody because they're always going to they're always going to one up you. They're going to they're going to they're going to tell you to go kill Joe Schmo and then he's going to have three friends with him or two friends at least. And then they're just going to gang up on you. So you got to get good faster. So this way, it's a little bit easier to uh, digest if you just do cargo. If you want to get into flower hunting later, I'm all down with that. Well, the Type 9, the only reason I didn't mention the Type 9 is because it's really expensive, right? I have a Type 9, uh, when you first, uh, if you're fir if you're first starting out, to be able to afford a Type 9 is pretty spendy. To be able to get into, say, a Python, it's going to be a lot cheaper. Now, Python ain't cheap, but the Mark III is actually very... That's like the second ship I had. I think I had a I had a Sidewinder, I went to a Mark III, and then I immediately went to a Vulture. But I wanted to go into combat, and I wasn't concerned about money. But you will be concerned about money. Now, the money is just for to buy the ships... There's a lot of other things you got to do, but I just kind of wanted to give my two cents on how you might want to start out. Now, if you're coming back, if you're coming back, you've been gone a while, depending on how long you were gone, you know, you're going to need, if you want to get up to speed on what's going on now in the game, you got to get those, you got to get the engineers open, and you, and it's it's helpful to either have the engineers or the Guardian Tech or both, either way. I actually went through the process of getting both. Um, so, uh, that took me about, I think it took me about three months. I think it took me to really get rolling again, but I didn't have any engineers open. I didn't have any guardian tech. I didn't have anything. So it took me a hot minute because I had to build, I had to build a ship just for fighting after I sold my warship. Obviously that wasn't working anyway. I had to, get the engineering to build the warship so I could fight. And so I built a crate for that. Yeah. Now, Entropy's talking about he went from a hauler to a Type 6 to a Type 7 and then a Type 9. Those are all cool ships, right? But I think the Python can actually carry more than a Type 7. So... There's that. And Python can be set up for fighting if it needs to be. I think the Python does take uh, does and it definitely hauls more than a type six. So yeah, so you want you want well, what I suggest you want is you want maximum. I know no the type six, the type seven, and the type nine are designed for cargo, but anybody that's been in the game a while knows that the Python and the cutter hold more cargo than either of those other ships any of those other ships so i'm just trying to you know skip you through now if you want to go through those channels that's fine but yeah the python is really good actually i don't know if the crate holds as much space as a python or not but they're both very similar the crate 2 which wasn't available when i left um that was one of the first ships that was one of the first ships i bought when i got back after i sold my uh after I sold my uh, Corvette, which I have purchased back, so it's here uh, somewhere. There it is, Amun Ra. This ship is really cool. So bought back Amun Ra, put him together. Actually, I wouldn't mind taking him out because he's got. I got him all set up. I just have. I did take him out a couple weeks ago, I think it was, and I got killed in it. But I was just screwing around, and I was getting sleepy. So, you know. Things happen. I don't even know. Let me see if there's even any. Um, what's going on in this system? I'm thinking about taking the carrier out of the front lines for right now because there's really not that much for me to do this week. And the the there were no invasions, and I think all the uh, alert systems have been cleared by now. So probably not much going on. No, I didn't want. To um also if you're playing on a if 
you're playing on a controller rather than a joystick, the experience is much different as well, too. So I don't think that... I mean, I think you have to put a lot on the keyboard if you're using a controller. Hello, Admiral. Felicity. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> wow, that is a cool name. Welcome, Commander 07. Just talking a little bit of Elite. Maybe thinking about... I'm going to go see if there's a conflict out here or something. I don't see anything going on here. I don't remember if there was any extractions there or not. I'm probably going to have to go outside. The, uh, let's see, carrier auto. Now, I think I have my, um, I, ha I did, I got to quit doing this, but I got a pilot the other day, like, so I could have somebody go out and, uh, and I put, um, I put the, uh, the, um, why can't I think of the name? I keep wanting to cuddle a shuttle. It's not a shuttle. This little guy. Those little, uh, the little ships with those pew pews on them. I can't remember the name of them now. I don't know why. It just slipped my mind. It must be the pink, uh, in the chat there. It's just throwing me off. But the, uh, yeah, I got that. Fighters. Yes. Is that what you guys call them, SLFs? Okay. SLF, Shift Launch Fighters. This actually has two of them in it. Um, and I haven't, I haven't sent them out. I'm going to see if I can find a conflict nearby. Actually, I just want, let me see right here, too. See if there's anything in here. Because I've been in the system for like three weeks. Probably time I move on. But I do like the system. <laughs> Sometimes there's an extraction. I think this one had an extraction in it one time. It looks like it should have one. Which means I can just go in there and shoot bad guys, which is really what I want to do. Yeah, it's Zooks. I wonder if I should just go out and scan the system and see if I can find one. Maybe. Let's do it. Alright. Taking a big boy out. I haven't flown this ship in a hot minute. Ship. Yeah. Ship launch fighters. Yeah. I just call them little, peep, little, little ships with the peepees on them. That's what I think they should be. Release confirmed. You have this off. Do I not have auto dock on this thing? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Tell my joystick's cold, man. It's all wompy. Alright. Landing gear. Landing module retracted. Okay, now we're moving. Yeah, my, my joystick will chill out. It's just feels like it's got flight assist. Oh, there it goes, it's tightening up. Okay, I just gotta move it around a little bit. Get the ball bearings going there. <laughs> so yeah, we'll see if there's a we'll see if there's a thing here. I might need to move the carrier somewhere. I haven't moved this carrier in a hot minute. You have now the no I'm close Best to I'm close to a lot of stuff where I could do uh, AX hunting, but I wanted to do something a little different. Leaving system. Ha. Well, I mean, you know, I'm not hurting for money right now. So, <laughs> I mean, I think I'm almost at seven billion now. So, I'm doing okay. I came back when I came back. I came back and I had 350 million. Got my butt kicked scan. all the way down to uh, 50 million. Had to sell my Corvette. And then I bought, then I went out and did the rep grind to get the cutter so I could do the, the missions I was just talking about, the, the cargo missions, back and forth. And I did that for probably three, four days. I can't remember. It's not where I want to go. Okay, let's go ahead. Scanner. 
Yes, Commander. Let's see what's out there. And this, the FSS now works really well. I, it sucked when I used to. When it first came out, it was terrible. What the hell? There's not human signal sources here? Why is there not human signal sources here? That's what I want to know. Hmm. Must just be close enough to the goids. Huh. Anyway. That's weird. Said there were four under... Okay, here's one. Oh, wow. So it does have some... It has some goid stuff in here. Looks weird. I don't know you can... Yeah, that's just all goid stuff. I didn't think that was, like, half possible in, uh... Well, at least one more. Tell me he's not behind the sun. Yeah, there's at least one or two more. Where are they, though? Oh, there's one. Well, that's not exactly what I was looking for. I was looking for an extraction. There was an extraction here a couple weeks ago. Oh, look at all these. Ooh, yeah, there's lots of there's a lot of goity stuff in there. I want. I just don't use it with the AX because. Um, The, um, yeah, the ships definitely don't do any damage against Thargoids. So. The little launch fighters, but they do okay in, like, how did all this stuff just come up? <laughs> There's a lot of stuff going on in here, but it's all goity stuff. Interesting. I've been working on, um... Hey, Dr. Dabs. Uh-oh. Hell, I'm getting pulled over. Who's pulling me over? I don't know what I'm pulling me over. Who is it? They're probably killing me. Awaiting order. orders. Warning. Shield breach attack. Thunder attack. Taking damage. Oh, that's cool. Engage FST. Jumping. Powered engines. Rerouting power. Wow, oh, that's insane. This is weird because this this system's not even under alert, right? So they're still hanging out here. Huh. Well, I mean, I am right next door to Thargoid Control System. Where is my engage FSD? Frame shift drive engaging. Oh. God damn it. Uh. I know it's a little bit. <laughs> I want to. Oh. Look this way. Boy, it's been so long since I had to undo something. I forgot. Here we go. I didn't know I had that stuff selected. Okay, now we should engage FSD. Look at my shields are holding up, though. Look at that. I've never played with a shield ship around these guys before. Yeah, I, I can't remember which ones I have. Engage FSD. Um, Four, three, two, one, oh, oh, well, I did not know that. I thought we were over pushing them, that there's like nothing to do this week. No, I don't want to go there. I wanted to go in here. I wanted to go to a uh, I've never, I've never, I've been here for like three weeks and I've never been, um, never been pulled over like this. He's a very <laughs> naughty boy. Okay, okay. 
Commander, what are your orders? I'm all kind of confused right now. Man. This is weird. Taking damage. These little guys are getting on my last nerve. You guys don't want me to get the big boy. Where do they want us to fight? In the Maelstrom? We'll make it so we can get in the damn thing. Maybe people will fight there. I don't know. Where do they want us to fight? Or, or they want us to fight in those purple areas, right? I don't even go in there because I don't get it. I don't even understand what that is. All right, let me see if I can get in there. Why, did I accidentally jump out of the system? I did, didn't I? I'm confused. Oh, I did. I jumped out of the system. How the hell did that happen? Alright. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I was like, why is this not right? Something's wrong. Okay, that's good. Let's go back to my system. They got me all con they got me all discombobulated. Yeah, I wonder why. I want to know where they think we should be fighting. Is it the the only thing I can think of is Course if they want us on the front, on the f ones where we take back. I don't, I don't really understand any of that. I don't know too many people that are actually streaming anything about that. How to even work those? I don't, you know. And I mean, I'm a member of some discords that have that information, probably, Scanning but. Information. Most people just, you know, keep telling you to RTFM, read the manual and stuff. And that's like, I don't want to read the manual. Just tell me what the hell we're supposed to do there. Are we supposed to get into those? The problem, and the other thing, I, the other problem I have with those systems, the, the pushback systems, is that the, 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 all the conflicts there have no repair. You can't, you can't put a carrier in there with you. You can't. You know, there's no station, there's no nothing. So, they already know that we like the ones with the stations in them. Why they keep wanting to take those away, I'm not sure. But nobody's going to do them until they're easier to do. At least I'm not. In unless there's a station, I'm not really interested in doing it. I mean, I've tried, man. I go in there, I try to do it without a station, and it just doesn't work out for me. I've, I mean, I've been able to kill like maybe one Cyclops in space. And that's it. <laughs> and I've been trying. I've been practicing. Let me go. I'm going to have to go put this guy on the... Because I'm not sure what's going on around here, but these guys are making me mad. Let me go over near my carrier, though. So. It's got me down two whole percent. My hull on this thing is terrible because this is a shield tank. So if they shoot absolute damage at me, this thing's going to get tore up. This thing's going to get shredded. I might just have to move this carry out of here. Yeah. Hold on a second. Let me just get out of there. Okay. That should be fine. Um... Yeah, I don't see, and I don't like to do that either. I don't want, I don't really want notoriety, and I don't want, well, you shouldn't get notoriety there, should you, at the, at the pushback systems in the purple ones? I mean, isn't that Thargoid controlled, and then you just got to go kill the, or go get, op turn stuff on from the revenants or whatever? That was the first thing. It took me a few weeks just to figure out where to even get the, to get the, uh, what's that called, the, uh, the, the quests or the work orders, or whatever the hell they call them, to go get the, to go do the, the flip the switches back on, and I'm not really, I'm not really familiar that much with those ground missions, I never did them before I left, they didn't exist. Yeah, no, not that, not the dot. I'll show you here when I get this thing landed. Let me see if my... 
because my um, I'll show you about where I think they want us to put. Please follow standard docking protocols, Commander. You have been cleared for approach. Feel free to relax. Your docking computer is in control. Oh, that's a benefit, you say? <laughs> I don't like Thargons. The Thargons are worse than the Thargoids. I'd prefer just to have. I'd prefer to fight glaives than those Thargons. And I don't even carry the thing to kill them with, the flak thingy. I don't even have that. Let me get this thing on the deck, because there is some weird honey, stuff I'm going hungry. on here. I never got pulled over like that. All right. Well, maybe, okay, maybe that's what it was. Maybe I wasn't in this system. Our services are at your disposal. Okay, I think that I screwed up. I may not, they may not be here. I thought they were in this system, but I think I jumped to the next system over, which is probably Thargoid control. If you stay under 30K. Are you talking about on the surface? Well, yeah, I'm just trying to figure out. You're talking about a surface mission. Yes, okay. So, yeah, I get that part, but the... You can't... Can you land on the ground there and get refueled, though? That's what I need to know. I don't think you can. I don't think you can get refueled or rearm or repair or any of that. That's the part I don't like. I wish that you could still do that, because that's, like, my favorite thing to do. I've got like 8 million videos of those. Pay fine, then repair. Yeah, I got that part. Pay a fine. Now, why are, why are we paying a fine? What, what are we doing that's causing us to have to pay a fine? Yeah, I've, I'm 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 pretty deep into the Thargoid thing. I've done a lot of surface missions. Matter of fact, I can show you that right here. So if you just look at just my stuff, where's my stuff? Just anywhere, just go into one. I'm sure there's another way to do this. But. Okay, yeah, see, here's my stats on the Thargoid thing. I do all surface missions, but you're telling me in the purple systems you can do this too? Oh, it's a no-fire zone there. Okay, all right, that means, okay. So do you get a fine every single time you use your damn weapons? You're in a green system. Okay, hold on. Let me let me show uh, entropy what I was talking about, where I think they want us to fight is. All right, so I'm looking at the Thargoid map. So, yeah, I think what happened was I accidentally jumped into one of these green ones. That's why I was getting pulled off. Um, these systems right here, the ones with the purple thing over them. 300 credits per shot. Jesus. Wow. Man, you got to have some... Good thing I got deep pockets. See, this is what I thought you guys were talking about were these systems. These are the... I know I know what you meant. You meant the, the, the purple dot, but that's not what I meant. I was... Purple dots in recovery, yes, but these purple arrows or whatever the hell it is, that's the systems I think they love being saved. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, well, see, this is the, this is the thing. Is This is what I think, because this is the thing they just added a few weeks ago, right? These, these systems here. But I don't understand what you're supposed to do in them. I don't even think I've been to one. Maybe I have. Let me see. Not that one. 
Oh, oh yeah, there was one that was nearby, but I couldn't figure out exactly what was going on there. There was one that was right in here. Next to, this is Tyrannus, Tyrannus here. Um, oh, here it is. Yeah, 29E. I've been in that one. Yeah, see, I've been in that one, so I can look at that one. And I can see what's going on. But I don't understand what, okay, so what are you supposed to do here? That's what I, this is the whole thing I don't understand. Like, how are you supposed to figure this out? Stargoid controlled, but it's got that little wing dinger above it. But I don't get what that means. Just, just AX con, so the, yeah, so the conflict zones, again, you can't take any, you can't take, uh, you can't repair in those. So I don't know how you're supposed to get through them. Like, you know what I mean? Because if I take a, if I take an AFM in there, I can only repair, well, it depends on which guns I take. But if I do, if I do, t if I took guardian weapons in there and they shut them down, I'll only be able to heal those three times. Now, if I take the other, I have AX guns, but holy sweet Jesus, those multi cannons take a long time to kill stuff. Yeah, see, and I've been doing that, but I'm not real good at it. I, I usually get killed before I can get anything. And the repair takes forever. Which AFM do you guys use? I was just using a level 3 or a level 5, but... Well, I mean, one of my ships has a level 7 on it, but... Or class 7. Size six. Well, you know, I may look into that guardian. Charges for the, oh, for the AFM. Interesting, maybe. I don't know if I have the stuff. I have to make sure I got the stuff. That's the other thing is I never did that before. I never did the synthesizing stuff until I came back and I needed gas for my SRV a couple times. And at first I didn't have any way to do that. So I just had to pack up and go to a fleet carrier and re reload and then come back down. Once I started getting enough materials, I started refueling on my own and rearming, but I don't usually need to rearm. Yeah, see, I'm not real good. Not not real not real good with the cold orbit thing. I do have the beams though. I got tons of them beams, man. Me and Brew were tight. We're like this. Me and Brew Tarquin. Man, I've seen that dude a million times. I got so many damn uh <laughs> beams with the thermal vent on them. You just can't even shake a stick at them. I got lots of them. Um hmm. So yeah, this is all conflict zones. Isn't that isn't that where you think don't you think that's where they want us to fight though? Cuz they just added that thing a few weeks ago, so that must be like that's where they thought we were going to all go hang out. But like I just don't know if anybody's doing it. I mean, even on the <laughs> cold orbit Well, I hope you can only do like yeah. Me and FA off. We're not we're not friends. Yeah, flight assist. That's that's my buddy. Cause otherwise, you think I fly crazy now? You should see how I look when I ain't got that thing on. I'm just like ah, 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 and my ship goes everywhere. Yeah, I'm not that steady, man. Not that steady. I think my my steady handed days are passing me by. Um, okay, so that's, but I think that's where they want us to fight. Um, so, yeah. Now, I'm going to check that one more time. Now, that's why I couldn't find anything. So let's see if there's any un, undiscovered stuff in this sector.
Ah. Yeah, I just don't quite get it, so I'm not sure what's going on there. Try to launch this guy. I'll try not to launch to a different system this time. Clerk release confirmed. You have this off. Yeah, okay, you lost me on that one. Uh, just watch distance over 3K. You can be over 20% heat and under 3K on attack. Oh, you mean, uh, okay. I don't usually, only time I heat up is under, uh, yeah, yeah, 20%. Yeah, that's what, one of my ships does run under 20%. This, well, this one definitely doesn't. It's at 39 right now, but my other one, my other AX1 does not run that low. Um, yeah, I do have a ship I could probably do that with. Because I have one where I built it uh, efficient, so it'll run colder. It runs at like 18. Or 15 to 18. Let's see if I can get out here without getting... I think I, I think I just screwed up and went to another system, that's why. And didn't realize it, because I was screwing around, I was thinking about going to do something. And then I changed my mind. Alright, so we should be in the same system now. Alright, scanner. Scanner. One moment, please. Yeah, don't, don't get lippy on me, I'm a little miss. Alright, now let's see what we got. We got anything good now. Holy fucking, look at all this stuff in here. Oh, these are all carriers. I don't care about that. Holy buckets. Okay, so that's cool. I just want, actually what I want is I want extraction. But I don't think these are going to be that. There's lots of little places to hang out in here, though. A lot more than you'd think. I've never gone into a degraded. Encoded? Hmm. Not so sure. No, I don't know if I've been into an encoded. Usually I go after stuff for weapons. Holy cow, there's a lot of stuff in here. I've never seen this much. It's created, encoded. There's not much else though. I don't see any, um... Should have whipped out the guns in that system to see how it does against how that ship does against scouts. Might not be terrible. A lot of stuff in here. Because extraction extraction's usually near. Uh, I don't know, there's so much I don't remember about how to play this game. Or so much I miss that I don't, don't even know exists yet. I mean, I didn't have a fleet carrier. I got a fleet carrier about a month ago. Maybe a little bit more now. Love that thing. There's just a ton of stuff going on in here. Yeah, I saw it today, but... Yeah. Well, they're just... They're, they're, they're only active for things that... There it is. I don't want hazardous, though. I want like noob, newbie one. Oh, there it is. I seen it. Let's go. We're gonna go to this low one. No, low, low, low. Wait. Wait, stop. There. All right, we'll go to a low. Oh, yeah. The last hit. I still do last hit. Yeah, I don't like that. Yeah, I usually, I try not, I try to fly alone unless I'm going with a friend, you know? Because that way I know that we can split up that kind of thing, you know? I don't really care about the the stats other than I need 10 Hydras that I'll probably never be able to get. But, um, it's the only stats on Anara that I don't have um, because I haven't, 
I mean, I've killed some hydras with my friends, but always somebody else gets the last hit. Oh, is that why? Okay, because we killed four one day, and one guy got all the credit for all four of them. So that makes sense. That was annoying. This is what I wanted earlier. But I start to yip yapping, and I forget what I'm doing, or I do the wrong thing. Oh, is that what it is? Okay. Yeah, I'm not, I'm kind of an introvert, man. I don't I don't, <laughs> I don't I don't just like go in there and be like, hey, fellas, you know, I don't, can't do it. I feel weird. What's going on here? Oh, my fleet carrier upkeep. Oh, I was there that day. Oh, that's probably why I got the message, huh? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not real good at just going in and making a wing. I don't fly. I haven't flown in open in years. <coughs> okay, we're coming in. Let's go right there. What do you think of that? I love fighting some. I love Cyclops. That's my favorite. But you notice that thing they did where the Cyclops doesn't always joust you anymore. It'll, it focuses more on the other commander than the uh, AI commanders than it does you. I can't hardly put, I used to be able to put them away so fast when they would just joust me right out of the gate. I can still get them once in a while, but it's not like it was, man. I used to be able to put Cyclops away like insane numbers real quick if you looked on my list I got way more Cyclops than I do anything else yeah yeah you can't yeah because they keep turning I was doing the stream I did last weekend I was bitch about that like 20 times because they I'd get lined right up on the pedal and they'd be like Voop, and they'd flip and shoot a different AI commander and I was like those those devs are just evil. They're so evil. They're totally trying to suck the fun out of this whole war thing. Well, fortunately, they did turn it down a little bit because they were, the first few weeks, we were getting our asses handed to us big time. And I don't think hardly anybody was doing Everybody was terrified to do it. And I'm just like, yeah, just, you know. I did it with a couple friends, so, you know, I just jumped in there with a couple friends and we beat the holy be Jesus out of them. And then we, we went and built, you know, the ship so they were better. My, my AX ship is not, not terrible. All right, now we're in the, now we're, okay, this is old school stuff. Hold on, I'm, I got to remember how to do this stuff. Okay, we got peeps. We got peeps. I think I can launch my fighter now. Deploy. Oh, what happened to my chip? Oh, I got a. I didn't turn her on. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. I forget. I got. I guess I. I didn't make her active. Wait. Wait. Where's the? Do I have to do this at a station? I had her in there before. All right, hang on. Well, we can just, we can go fight for a little bit. I'll go get her in a little bit. I see some shooting. This guy's gotta be clean, right? Yep, let's see where this guy is. Wanted! Well, in that case, let's get out some weps. And that thing's new too, the whole mode thing. I don't even know what the hell that is. That screwed me up for a little while. I couldn't figure out why I couldn't shoot. 
<laughs> I was like, what the hell? We didn't used to have a mode. We just shot stuff. What? You can't be kidding me. Wait. Oh, he's a little eagle. Come here, little eagle guy. I want to shoot you. I want to shoot you in the face. Ooh. Oh, shit. He died fast. Damn. Wow. Okay, that was not what I was expecting at all. Okay, who's shooting at me? Who's this? I can't see who's shooting at me. Oh, is he behind me? Is that what the problem is? Oh, there. Okay, okay. There's his buddies. Man, it's been a long time since I've done this. Hey, hey, hey. Slow down, slow down. That's what I wanted. Thank you. Let's see how fast you died. Oh, jeez! Man, holy spuckets, man. Did you guys see that? Ooh. Yeah, right? I know, right? They they changed that because it didn't used to work that way. But, man. Oh, my God. Yeah, no. that You know what I do appreciate about FDEV? I'll be honest. At least when they nerf something, they nerf it in a creative way. They don't just take away... They don't just take away the... Uh... <laughs> yeah, it's Zeus. Wow, this thing is just... Woo-wee, that thing is crazy. All right, well, let's find somebody else to blow in the smithereen. Man, that guy blew up quick. I wish I could kill the Thargoids that fast. Yeah, no, they, they do it, man, and it sucks. I had the same thing going on. I was like... Because it was, they didn't do that at the beginning. It was not till you know, a few weeks ago. They just all of a sudden, I mean, I was putting them down left and right, left and right. And then all of a sudden I noticed, you know, they did an up that 1502. They stuck a lot of crap in there that they didn't talk about. Yeah, I didn't even know about that gla little, little glaive action where the three glaives come out and literally shut off your entire ship. All right, we good. I haven't even had to, I haven't even had to put any power to my weapons yet. Let's just let's keep, okay. Let's do it like this. Hey, where are you going? I still don't see too far away from. Not used to this anymore, man. Oh, there it goes. They're going now. Hey, boys. Yeah, I know. You're going to die in two seconds. Wow, that was awesome. I like it. Oops. I hate when I do that. I've got a lot of uh, gimbal weapons on this one, so I didn't have to. Uh, so I didn't have to do a lot of thinking about shooting with what. I just turn them on and they shoot. All right, next. Who's next? Wants a little piece of this. Oh, he's already clean. Give me somebody dirty. Who's dirty? You dirty? Are you dirty? Are you a dirty miner? Yeah, I, I, uh, yeah, I know that. I do like that they, you know, instead of like, I don't mind that they shut your stuff off, but I do my, I do, I don't like the the three glaive thing where they totally, they can totally suppress you for like five minutes. That one's a little steep for me. I knew this, my friends have a loadout similar to mine, but I wanted to make sure mine was like. There he goes. He won't die. Poof. He poofed. They don't. These guys don't die quite as big as the Thargoids. Though. I like the Thargoid death much better. <laughs> Watch them just explode. This isn't terrible. 
This is a cool ship. I wish I would have had my dang. Oh, what's this guy? He looks. He, he looks. He looks bad. What's he doing? Clean. Come on. Oh, are you guarding that other guy? That's cool. You. That's nice. Oh yeah, this is another miner. He ain't gonna win that. I just took a low one because I was afraid if I went into a high one, I was gonna get chat. What is that? Oh, that's okay. He's gonna be, he's gonna come along. We don't want to shoot those guys, right? No, we don't shoot the green guys. Yeah, I don't. I don't mind fighting them as long as they're not able to shut off my gun. <laughs> That's the only yeah. If if they shut off your guns, you're kind of you're kind of out of luck at that point. You just have to deal with the punishment and then get out. But yeah, so that that one's a little rough. I think too. I don't see, and that's the other thing too. Like the glaives, they shut off all your guns, like literally every single gun, and all at the same time, and they they all they all decay at the same rate. So it's like really, it's a challenge to make sure that if it does happen, you have to get out. But I, I also thought about doing a hybrid, like an AX cannons with, you know, the uh, shard cannons as well, the AX multi cannons. But uh, I just, I don't, it doesn't feel right flying it because it then then you're not you're just not doing enough damage and the the chances of you running into a glaive is low enough that it's not worth my time to to mess up my whole build just for that now i did find out i know entropy mentioned this last week too um if you see them if you hear them come out bum, 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 because it just goes boom, boom boom real fast then you immediately at least whack one of them and then that pretty much negates their whole their berserker thing is not as powerful with two as it is with three. Ooh, this guy, what's he doing? Hey, what are you doing over there? Aha! You're wanted, bro. Oh, you come and skin. I should have put some. I should have put. Sneak it behind a rock. Um. Should have put a piece of gold in my cargo. Hey, buddy. Still 11 out. Are you shooting my friend? Are you shooting? The, are you shooting my friend? Hard engine. Okay, executing now. Need more oof. You get used to flying a ship like this, where it's nice and quiet. It's got a lot of power. And then you get into like a, a get into like a the Challenger or the Chieftain, and it's just like engines are literally right next to your head. There it goes. He's going down now. Say goodnight, Gracie. Man, you died fast. I'd like to say nice move, but I think we both know that was incredibly lucky. What? Come on, Kate. Okay. You gotta be mean. Bye-bye. These guys aren't worth as much as the goids, I'll tell you that. Oh my god, those things are loud, man. I had to like... I was like gonna get some earplugs or something, because those things are loud. Where's he going? Oh, you're clean? You're lucky. I would've came for you, bro. Okay, he's clean. Who's scanning me? Is this guy? He's clean too, watch. Nope, he's not clean. Bye. Uh, wow. Where is my cup? Cup. Hey there, buddy. 
Damn, I didn't even shoot him with Great the other shot, guns. That's one in a million. <laughs> that was one in a million, huh? Man, that guy nasty. This ship is nasty, dude. This is a. F this thing is fully engineered. It took me forever, but I got her. Got her done. Yeah, those Chieftain engines ain't no joke, bro. Things about took my eardrums right off the, off the stems there. I haven't been in one of these. I used to do this stuff all the time. Aha! Hard engines. Towering engines. Somebody's going down. This is almost too easy. Let the cat in. Feed the cat. That's affirmative, Commander. Yeah. We'll keep you busy. Keep you satisfied. Keep you from talking more smack to me. Whilst I'm in here just hitting that cat's loud. Yo, kitty, you are noisy. Come on, we gotta find another place. We're patrolling the area. System security. Commander Fear. At your service. What was that here? That was it. Okay. There's a false alarm. I like this. This is kind of relaxing. It's like fishing. Hard engine. Mux engines. She's just, I don't even know what that means. What does that mean? Hey, thanks for the follow. Um, yeah, I'm still learning some things, but that's kind of why I keep playing, because I'm still learning a bunch of stuff. I missed a lot of stuff when I was gone. Being human, your actions, your thoughts, your emotions, someday I will experience them all. Sounds amazing. That sounds amazing. Alright, you're wanted. You're wanted, then. Get wrecked. we got over here. I don't know if I'm ready for the big big leaves yet. But... Whoa, shoot. Let me help. Let me help. Let me get him. Oh, you guys killed him before I got his Jeez. Damn, guys. You didn't even let me tag him. I wanted to get the wanted up first because God knows this game will rob me. This is the, the Corvette though, man. It sounds so cool. It sounds like a hot rod. Sounds like a motorcycle. Almost like a... Like a Harley. You can tell. You, you know you're driving in style when you're in the vet.
Yeah, this is really the first time I've messed around. This one's staying pretty good so far. I guess I'm probably in too low of a zone. I should probably go higher, but I don't know if I'm ready for hazardous just yet. I gotta go get my. I gotta go get my other pilot. Go get my pilot. What else is out here? Come on, one of you guys has got to be dirty. Give me a dirty birdie. So far, these guys aren't super hard to kill, so that's not terrible. Oh, that could be a. That could be a bad guy. He is. Taking me to celebrate? <laughs> That's fine. Not clean. Wait, I hear some shit. I hear shit. Can't see it yet. I will find it. Wait, there it is. Bigger boys. Was he in a wing of two? Ooh, he had he was worth a couple bucks, huh? It wasn't bad, not bad, not bad at all. Now we're Oh, I missed that for allowance. Dang it. Man, I, I like killing for allowance. What else is going on over here? These guys are ruthless. Limpet collector. And this guy, he's green. He's green. Wait. Ooh, what is that? Oh, it's a rock. <laughs> oh my! That looked like a Thargoid, man. I thought that was a Goid. I was like, no way. Oliver's journey, right? Yep. What about this guy? I know why they're dying, because they're so low. Uh, novice. Where'd the other guy go? Where is he? Are we scanning me? I figure out which way you went, I'm gonna get you. Oh, wait, come here. I see you, Nell, Neil. Are you dirty? You're dirty. You are a dirty birdie. Damn, you died fast. Whoo, damn. I should finish, um,. I should finish uh, engineering my um, Imperial Clipper, or my Imperial, uh, not Clipper, the little guy, Eagle, Imperial Eagle. Oh, there he goes. Damn, what is that? Look at all the explosions. That's a lot of explosions, man. What are they shooting at that poor guy? I never seen that. I can't. I I'm trying to follow the noise. I can hear him say. Bye bye. I'll take the money. Even though I didn't do most of the work there. All right. This is pretty good. How are we doing? We're doing okay, huh? 
Two million. <laughs> Two million. That's how, how quaint. I usually get out of bed for less than 40. All right. I think I'm going to get my pilot. Maybe we'll try something a little more. A little more dangerous. I haven't lost a ship in a while. Give me my, give me my carrier. What? We're gonna skim right across this this thingy, whatever this guy is. We're gonna skim across them. Oh yeah, that's cool. Well, that was that was that was awesome. Yeah, I've been in this zone forever. I like it here. I haven't been home in a while. I got it. We have a um, we have a system where we're uh, minor faction is and. Uh, I go there every once in a while, but we don't really play the background sim much anymore. It got to be too much, man. We used to have like six or seven systems that I remember. And it was just, it was really hard to keep track of all that. So I go home. I go over there every once in a while just to see it, to make sure we're okay, that we're still in control of the system, but. All right, going back out. We're going to get, I'm going to get my pilot. And then we'll go to a higher, go to a higher one, see how we do. See if I can get killed today. Because we stayed at pretty much 100% the whole time there. So you guys playing today or just hanging out? I took a couple days off. I was on vacation all week. I wanted to stream on Thursday, but there weren't any um, there weren't any invaded uh, ground systems, so I was like, "Meh, I'll wait till Saturday. <laughs> Do my normal day." Come on, baby, get me over there. I gotta turn, I think I just have to turn the, I gotta, I, I have a pilot. I've been paying her for a week or two. She's made some bucks off me, but it's not enough to get me excited yet. I might start trying to do those CGs again. And maybe I'll pick up a level six AF. <clears throat> I don't know. I'm just not a big fan. I'm not very good at that stuff. But, you know, it takes time. I'll keep working at it until I get it going or whatever. I got a lot of followers. Probably they never come to my channel anymore. But whatever. It is what it is, I guess. getting hit oh yeah staying cold that's that's a tricky situation
because the guns I use are very hot. It's kind of hard to stay cool when you're using hot guns, you know what I mean? Oh man, asking me if I'm going to take a nap or not is never a question. <laughs> just just do it. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to screw around with this for a little bit. I don't have anything really big planned today either. I just kind of wanted to play. I hadn't played. And I haven't played with this ship either. So. I was thinking about if I can if I, if I can finish engineering my Imperial Eagle, I might take that out at some point. I think I was pretty close. I can't remember what guns I had on it. I don't think I had anything excruciatingly awesome. Alright. You have been cleared for approach. Feel free to relax. Your docking computer is in control. Yeah, if, if there's a question of whether or not to take a nap, a nap is always a yes. Yes. Take a nap. You just never know. What is today? Saturday? Yeah. So I had my lunch early so I could come and do this for a little while. And hopefully the kitty will stay out of my hair. But you never know. My groceries came. Everything's good. Welcome. Contact confirmed. What the hell did we Commence shutdown. Welcome to our carrier, Commander. Now, we should be able to... So, she's got to be in here, right? Crew lounge. Yeah. Set active. Oh, that's what it was. Okay. Alright. Got her. Okay, now, what else? Okay, I think that was it. I think that's all I wanted. I was gonna look at. Oh, I don't want to do that. We'll just we'll just do that later. But yeah, I wanna I wanna look at my my little imperial eagle was a, is a lot of fun to fly around in. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, let's get out of here. Got my pilot. I'm gonna go to a higher extraction now. Let's see if I can not get dead. This thing is a shield tank, though. It's gonna take on a minute. Powered engines. Diverting power to engines. This thing's got a lot of power, but it ain't fast. Actually, I was thinking about maybe building a sm smaller ship and just building a cold one. See if I could do it. What is that? Okay, there's a there's a, there's one. We're at 2.1 million. That's terrible. <laughs> 2. 2.1 million won't even pay for my put pay for my bullets, man. What the hell? Hazardous. Well, I don't know. I should probably go. To, I should probably find a medium. But or should I just go for broke? Seems like a lot of them are hazardous.
It's interesting. Okay, they got these two little systems over here and they both got... I'm assuming they're out. They both have rings. Lots of hazards over here, man. Unidentified. Yeah, I got guardian. I got guardian um, fighters. All right, see you in a minute. I might sit down here and... Oh, I saw you came online there. Interesting. Or they're really dim. One or two. does have a ring. It's really light. I thought it should have a ring. Going in hot. Oh boy, getting down here. The bumps. Probably wait a minute for the warm up. I can hear my little ship flying around me. Wait, I see another one out there. Where are you? Aha! Found you, little holler man. He's deadly. Hello.
cool ass shit. Good going. Good going, partner. be fun. Your ship AI, I should get a cut of that. You think? Where did he go? There he is, I see him over there. some bucks. No more contact. Deactivating hard points. Oh, <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> I never heard that before either. That was my buddy. Painful, bro. That looks like you had some hurting on you. Wait, there's like three ships back here. These are all. That's not a mine. Alright. Hey, Charles, how's it going, buddy? Waiting for you. Need somebody to fly my other ship. Oh, boy. Oh! that rock twice. Where was I going? Oh. There's a guy back here. I'm going to go get him. Doing all right, man. I sent you a message on the Discord.
team of three. Roger that, Commander. Moving to engage. Yeah, do it. Oh, man, you just blew up the mines. Move, but I think we both know that was incredibly lucky. That was not lucky. Fire up all them guns. That's the last of them, Commander. Okay, thank you. Crap flight now here. I can't see where I'm doing. Oh, here we go. Out in here, there's like rocks all over the damn place. It's a python, it might be a bad guy. It is. Oh, yeah? That's good. It's good. I hope it's bad. It's okay. Boy, shield cell bank. Charging. Boy, heat sink. Heat sink deployed. Almost worth a half a mil. Hey, Dino, how's it going? Oh, okay, good. 
Yeah, I figured. I don't think you've been gone so long. It's you could probably just make a new one, and it wouldn't even make any difference. I'm just shooting regular things today. Smooth, but Enemy I think we both down. know that was incredibly lucky. Okay, thank you. Let's see where this guy is. Oh, he's in a way. Charles got a copy of Odyssey yesterday. He's getting ready to come in. I made it so he can't ignore me anymore. Clean. That's not what I was expecting. Get him. Oh, he's clean. That sucks. There's a lot of action over here. There's some fighting going on. Go 
get Andrew. There he goes. He's on. He's in my sights. solo right now I can switch <clears throat> I usually play solo unless somebody else is around Say nice move, but I think we both know that was incredibly lucky. No more hostiles detected. We're out of hostiles. Okay, recall, recall fighter. Fighter recall. Mega ship under attack by Thargoids. Okay, let me, uh, I gotta talk to my chick here. On my way, Commander. Fighter retrieval commencing. External camera. Okay, executing now. Oh, she went in too fast. 
and I... God dang it. She went in too fast. I couldn't catch her. Alright. Retrieval process complete, Commander. It is. I can jump right through there. One, it All right Ooh, then. Yeah, there we go. That is fun right there. Some big old rings, bro. Carrier, the carrier. Mega ship under attack by. Th are you sure that's not even gonna? Is that just like a static thing, or what is that? Because they usually don't last long. Mega ships. They're kind of wimpy. I've seen some mega ships in the Goids area. They don't last long. Yeah, they need to. Uh, they need to beef those things up a little bit. It's been. It's been a decade. They should have got some new weapons by now. Okay. Okay, I'm just going back to carrier for a minute. How are we doing on seven million? Got seven million bucks today. Ooh. 
He's got me thinking about a nap. the dog. That's a negative. Docking permission is unavailable. You're outside the 7.5 kilometer range for docking requests. Yeah. Access granted. Please follow standard This is the protocol. only Commander. the only time anybody well you have been not really there's but most of the time they don't tell you what it is. Yeah, I don't even know what that means, but it sounds amazing. <laughs> cargo, cargo hatch is this. Well, yeah, I would never do anything without the I can't do any X stuff with this thing. This thing will get tore up. Well, I'm pretty happy with Amun Ra. That's a pretty badass ship. Welcome back. Landing successful. Clamps engaged. What can we do for you, Commander? Well, I want to turn in some brown brownie brownie points brownie bounty vouchers but I think before what kind of oh. I'll change over to the green one Alright, and then I'm gonna have to go on a little break. Kitty's here, and uh, I need to take a little pause for a cause and that kind of stuff, so be right back. Yay, I'm here. Let's go kill some stuff. Acknowledged, Captain.
Affirmative. Stand by. Flawless as always. Getting us out of here. Alrighty. Back. Oh. So we're gonna switch to something. I'm in my other one. Thanks, Charles. So what the hell am I doing? All I know is I got an anaconda here. Let's see what we got on it. I think this is the one that I can do repairs on. Okay, no. I don't think I have a level six AFM. No, I have a five is the biggest one I got. My cat, my cat still wants attention. Yeah, I see you down there. She's a brat. She's spoiled rot. It's not my fault. I think it's Dino. All right, so. Okay. So that's good. How much did I pay her, man? 12%. She gets a lot of money. She got, she, what? Okay. 
Oh, okay. What's all that noise? Are you making all that noise? Yeah, you still want attention? Still wants attention. Okay. So, yeah, I could take this one pretty much anywhere. It's just, yeah, I'm just not real. Yeah, this one does not run cool, though, I'll tell you that. This thing is fireball. And what, what else, uh, what was the utility mounts on them? Depends on what I was doing with them last. Okay, so it's just one. One caustic, the rest are all heat sinks. Okay. All right, that's good. Fifty. This thing's got like a two jump, two light year jump. Um, oh, oh twenty five. So there's two jumps. I know Charles will forget to remind me, so did it myself. Hmm. Interesting. Yes, that's interesting. Why is that mega ship over there? What system? And are you in the, the private group or no? No. Oh. Okay. Ah. Hmm. Wait, how do I, how do I read those again? Where you're at. Three jumps. That's because I put limpets in there. Alright, heading over that way. The ship is destroyed. 
Well, then I don't need to go. <laughs> well, uh... Well, I mean, he's flying around in a mountain world. What does he think? Yeah, you don't need shield. You can't use shields for uh, Orthros or uh, Orthros or uh, Thargoids. That would be very bad. But the upside is that's a hell of a lot easier to build a shield uh, hull tank than it is a shield tank. One last thing. That's why I was telling you. That's why I gave you that list of engineers because those are the ones you're gonna need. Jumping to At some point. System. That's why I was asking you if you had um, guardian tech or engineers open because you need one or the other, and you're gonna at least need to get to like level. At least I'd say it's level three. Confirmed. On some of that stuff to keep your ship from getting blowed up. Because the Thargoids do, uh, Thargoids do, um, absolute damage. They don't, so you can't build, so if you build something with thermal or whatever, um, that's not going to help you. So you need, like, pure, like, hull. You need, you need the most toughest hull you can get. So if you can get, if you have the Guardian stuff, then it's just easier because then you don't have to engineer it. But you can only, you can't, then you can't engineer human module uh, support, but you can, but you can't use, or you don't want to use Guardian uh, module support. So Adjusting for basically jump. no engineering if you go get the Guardian stuff. And the Guardian stuff's not hard to get, and it's not really not much of a risk. Yeah, okay, so you might have Felicia. I don't know, do you know what kind of ship you're even thinking about building? Are you going to do some kind of... Because you can do rescue missions and shit. Rescue, if you do rescue, it's even a lot easier. Instead of trying to do fighting, because when you do fighting is when you got to do your guns. Um, I don't know why I'm going over here, but... Just for the funsies, I guess. Shift drive charging. Um... Yeah, I mean, if you wanted to build a, a rescue ship, I would either build, I mean, you could build like, system. you could build a crate or a chieftain, or, a, or you could build a python, or you could build a, an anaconda, which I think anaconda is probably the best one. Adding Who said it was active again? Your other account? I don't understand why you're. So, what is this place? Rosansky.
Yeah, he's online right now. He's in the team with me. I'm trying to get you to go on a team, then I can take you on my I can take you on my Corvette and you can fly one of the little fighters. There's not much going on here. Let's go to that. I guess we should go to that station. Who? You guys gotta tell me who you're talking about. I'm not sure what you're saying. <laughs> I'm like, he, who's needing funds? I don't know if Charles needs funds. I don't know. Uh, if he wants some, I might. Well, my first part of my video, I did. Don't drop you. Okay. I mean, don't drop to the station. No, he said Charles yesterday said or I think yesterday said he had like 1.5 billion, so he should have enough money to get stuff. Yeah. I'm just, yeah, I just figured I better get some gas on this thing if I go back home soon. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Scanner. Of course. Oh, shh. Ooh, there's high grades here. Yeah, I don't even see the tanker yet. A lot of stuff in here. Yeah, I don't even see the tanker yet. Huh.
High metal content. In here. The big system. I like these big systems. They always have lots of cool stuff in them. stuff out here. There it is. Oh my god, dude, he's like way out there. It's 255 light seconds out. Is that the one you were talking about? That's why I couldn't see it. Ammonia world. The map of the planets to be able to see it. <clears throat> Scanner. Right away, Commander. It seems to me that humans are content if they appear to be athletic, beautiful. That would be perfect for me, I believe. Yes, a perfect fit. And so it's decided. That is how I shall be when I become human, both beautiful and athletic. I see that it helps if you're very wealthy too. Perhaps you can also organize a line of credit for me to take advantage of. I will require things. Lots of things. things. Ain't getting shit. Alright, come on. Lots of stuff down here. Oh, no. Swift Grove General Hospital. What the heck is that?
Das ist ja ein Tons of encoded stuff here. It's a big system. I still haven't figured out which one's I'm on you. Oh, there it is. That's... Okay. Okay. Oh, that is good. Oh, that stuff. Oh, there's something. There's the one. Was that it? Oh, is it the naphtha? That's it. <laughs> it took me a while to find that thing, didn't it? Wow. How far away is that one? Well, it's a lot, hell of a lot closer than the other one. Man, that ammonia planet stayed hidden for a while. That <laughs> ammonia planet was like, oh, hells no, you're not finding me. No, no, no.
team signal. I don't see it. minutes since I use this stuff. Okay, this is like one of them little mini event things. Oh my god, that's a Hydra dude. Just trying to get me killed, ain't you? Diverting power to requested system. Yeah, that's a hydrogen. I'm gonna shoot him. Oh sh Oh my god. Run away? Well now you tell me. I don't think this is what you expected, is it? I thought, okay, well, we're gonna go for it. Let's go for it. I'm in. You need, well, I'm gonna probably, I'm gonna probably get another one here in a minute because this guy, these guys are messing me up. Okay, go, 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 go. Hard engines. A furnace. Get me down to 55. Oh, my lord. I don't think I'm going to make it. There's a lot going on here, man. Well, he think deployed. Well, he think it's in deploy now.
thing is, when you got him far away, you want him to stay far away. I keep turning around, he'll get closer. Get away from him. Maybe. See how he's way down at the bottom of that? I want him to stay down there. See that? It is inevitable that I will feel the I'm sensation your of physical butt. pain when I'm in human form. I won't right, be okay, to I'm going to the station. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, dude. I was like, oh, that's a Hydra. And then I was like, wait a minute, that's a Hydra. <laughs> Why are we, are we going after this dude? Okay. I mean, I'm in. If you're in, I'm in. I gotta go, I gotta go lick my wounds up real quick. <laughs> Hopefully I won't get pulled over. Well, I won't get pulled over by a Hydra, that's for sure. No, I don't, you know, I don't turn a lot because if you turn and he gets closer to you, he's going to keep you in a uh, mass lock and you don't want that. If you're going in a straight line and if he moves around, then he's losing ground on you. But, I mean, if you think about it, you know, straight line... If I turn, and then you know, I just what, so what I do is I get him flat on the on the ra radar. I get him as flat as I can, so he's not like up here or down here. I get him right in the center, and then I just keep him there. I keep him down there because then he can't, he won't gain on me. And because I can't, I can't outrun him when I'm mass locked anyway so and but he still couldn't hit me so what I did is I went cool too I went down to cold so that he would have trouble hitting me and that worked that got me enough time to uh, I could have kept deploying heat sinks but I was getting I wanted more power so I turned off the side of the running This is, that is weird because that should not, uh, I don't know why that event is there. Shit, I'm gonna to, I'm all discombobulated and stuff. It's like, wow, that's a high, and then I heard like, pew, 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 all these other ones coming in too. I was like, oh shit. A lot there. I mean, that's a cool little event, but I don't know why it's there. Yeah, we needed about 12 more guys on that run. Come on over to see this place. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. No worries. <laughs> Well, at least I didn't get dead. I don't care if I did. It was still, it was like... It was like, hey, that's not exactly what we were talking about earlier. He didn't mention a Hydra in there. I thought maybe he was trying to troll me or something. Wait, now see, if, if Dino was here, he would have went for it. And the only reason that Hydra went after me so hard was because I was running away. Anytime you run from a Hydra, a Medusa and a Hydra are both pretty pretty bad about it. They will chase you down as long as they can. You almost... If I wasn't so beat up from getting... There was another big one in there too because I got uh, neuralized and... The neuralizer, um, you know, they once I was neuralized, they started really, the uh, swarm, he had a big swarm too. That swarm was really tearing me to pieces. Access permitted. Plot route for approach to landing Look at that, my auto dock minor. still works. Sweet. Use of automated docking computer permitted. You are clear to hand over control. I don't want to wait for it. He's crazy. I would have went for it. If he would have went for it, I would have went for it too. And I'd be like, tally ho! I don't care. Let's do it. Do them. We'll do the best we can. <laughs> and die proud. 
Ah, jeez, what the hell? Freaking auto docker, smashing my head. Okay, mental note. Don't, don't go out and run with entropy. Crazy. All right. Now, what are we doing? What are we doing? I don't remember now. I, I'm all. So, hey, wait. I got right up to it and I was like, hey, wait a minute. That's a Hydra. I hadn't even read the chat yet. Well, they knew I was coming, dude. I got a pretty long list of of uh, Thargoid kills, man. They know me. See that? Look how many Orthrus I'm up to, bro. 35. And you can see, like, out of all the ones I killed, the most I've killed is, uh, well, I guess it's scouts now, but it was, it was interceptors for a long time. I went out when I was out last week. I killed quite a few scouts. Huh. <clears throat> but see that Cyclops? That's my boys right there. That's the ones I love. Basilisk. I got 88 Basilisk. That's not bad. Six Deuces. No Hydras, though. Hydras aren't even on my list because I have not gotten the credit for a Hydra yet. Um, the weapon that you want is called an AX multi cannon, and it's pretty easy to get. I don't. I think you can just get those off of uh, rescue ships. I don't even think you have to unlock anything. Check your stats. Oh, I'm ahead of you now, Dino. I already know that. Here's yours. I can't see your other stats because you have to. I can't see the ones that I just showed you for me. It only shows me mine. It won't show me yours. But this one will tell you. You got a lot. You got some decent amount of bassies. Yeah, you got your hydras because you cheated somehow. Your sisters. You want me to check out your sisters? <laughs> I don't know if I should do that. That could be bad. And I know I don't have as many. There are a lot of people got way more, way more kills than I do on, on uh, Thargoids, but I got a lot. I was checking out DHs the other day. He's got like he 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 said they were going and doing that stuff, but they only did it like one day. Ah, oh, well, see, I didn't start chasing the Orthrus till they started coming outside, and even then, as long as there's an invasion system, I never cared about the Orthrus. But I picked up a lot of those since you know, like a week ago because. Uh, that's all there was to do, really. We we cleared the, uh, and I was on vacation, so I did a lot that week. You gonna go? You gonna go back in there again, or I, I don't. I think that zone is pretty. Um, that's some kind of a. It's an event, but I'm not sure why it's there. But I like that they have those. It's just, I don't know how the heck you would have found it. You said you found it by accident. So what the hell is that? So, yeah, as far as uh, who, the who dami? Who the man? Who the man? Who the man? Who the man? Um, 
Yeah, just go to uh, find on the map, find a rescue ship. And I'm pretty sure you can get those weapons there. Um, so if you go on, see these things? Now, I'm not sure if you have to put it in Thargoid War Mode or not, but if you do, just that's over here somewhere. Right there. And then you can see the uh, rescue ships. They look like that purple or I mean green and blue and just go to any one of them and you should be able to get weapons there oh oh <laughs> really well that, that looked a little that looked a little more intense than a regular uh, scan the mega ship mission there brother <laughs> yeah that was that was Get your ass whipped by some some hydras. That's what that mission should say. Um, yeah. So that's where I'd go, Huda man. And you don't have to go to this one in particular, but I don't know where you're at in the galaxy, though. You have to be kind of over by the. You have to be over by the Thargoid thing. Would you go to the next system? Would you run away? You might, and sometimes, I don't know if this is true or not, but I think some of the rescue ships have better stuff than others. So, like, I know for a fact, like, this one's good. I'm pretty sure. Because I bookmarked it, so there's a reason I bookmarked it. It's probably got good stuff. Um, but there's another one. There's one called Forester. I usually always go to that one. They always have everything I need. But Highlander used to go on and on about double hull rescue ships had better stuff, but I don't know if that's true. But in any event, there's a ton of rescue ships all over the place. Just pick one, go to it. It should have some weapons for you to get started. And that's where uh, as soon as... Uh, Oh, you're in the process of getting back to the bubble? Yeah, you got to come back. You got to come back to the bubble before you get that stuff. Because anything you get from a guardian, if you get, I wouldn't, you don't really need guardian stuff. You know, just when you're getting started, you don't need guardian stuff. You just need but you definitely have to at least have um, Guardian, uh, or I'm sorry, AX stuff, which is human-based. But some humans may carry it, but if you want stuff that you don't have to unlock, you have to get it from the rescue ship. A lot of stuff has to be unlocked. Holy sweet Jesus, dude. Far away is that? Jeez, seven thousand light years. That's a lot, even in a carrier, man. Well, okay, so who da who da man? Uh, all you need, okay, ba ba bare minimum. All you need is the guardian hole. Because anything else you get, it's great to have. In certain spots, but for Thargoids, no. You only can use the Guardian Hall. And the weapons. Oh, okay. Well, then you got you got some work to do if you want to get back into this. <laughs> yeah, that's Yeah, that's the ones. Uh I can't read any of these names. Light uh, I don't even know if I want to try that. L84. <laughs> That's all. <I> can read. <laughs> um, yeah, the AX multi cannons are uh, 
Yeah, they're they're great. They can kill anything. It's just the amount of time that it takes. To, and so the AX, that's what I'm talking about, the AX gimbaled multi-cannon. So that's the one you want. Get that. Now, you're in a you said you were in a, a Phantom. I, I you could probably use a Phantom, but you're probably better off having a crate. Or the um, Chieftain. Just if you have the money, I'd get the crate because the crate is just, in my opinion, is a better ship. MK2, a Mark II. Yeah, crate Mark II. Yes, yes. Yeah, get that, the crate Mark II, because that's the one that, that's pretty much meta. And then you'll also, while you're at the mega ships, get. Um, here's what you want: you want one laser. Okay, it doesn't have to be a really big laser, but two, minimum. But the thing, what you really want is you want six or five. I'm sorry, five AX multi cans. And I can't show you exact loadout on this ship, but I do have. Kind of what the same thing that you'd need. So the Anaconda is just a bigger, bigger version. It's got bigger stuff. So you want to get. And this is just going to the rescue ship. I'm not talking about anything else. But you, but you do want to get the Guardian weapons at some point. So you're going to need. I'd pick up at least six Guardian weapon blueprints. And uh, at least six. I bought, I got a lot, way more than that, but I was like, I like trying out different stuff. So, um, so yeah, so you're going to need, uh, I can't remember, I think on the crate, so this one even has it, it has one, but see the beam lasers I'm using are little tiny ones, they don't do any good for this kind of thing, but if you're going to go fight, if you're going to fight in a crate, you're going to need at least one beam laser, and that'll go probably at the top. And then the rest you'll do uh, two, uh, class two AX multi cannons. I think I can show you one. And you got to make sure if they're, I don't remember if those are pre-engineered or not. They might be. Experimentals right here. You want, you want these guys. Yep, the two E enhanced. Multi AX multi cannons. And you want five of those, but to get five of those on your ship, you're gonna need one of the, you're gonna need one of these. I think you need the smaller one. Um, there's two different versions. I think one will let you have five, and the other one will let you have six, something like that. But hold on, core? No, no, it's down here. Okay. It's uh, this guy, experimental weapon stabilizer. This allows you to have more. Um, okay, yeah, so I think this one will get you up to six. The other one gets you up to five. I think the crate will only go to five. So the experimental weapon stabilizer that you need is a three, which is a class three. So that'll be smaller, so you don't have to pick up a, yeah. Yeah, that's what I use is the one size three uh, class 3 laser and it's got to be thermal it's got to be engineered thermal vent and uh, long range yeah you can do it with less than that you could do it without the stabilizer but why wouldn't you just just get the big ones get get the get them all get all the guns more guns the more better <laughs> Yeah. Well, Goss, Goss is okay, but Goss is okay, but I'm just telling you that the AX multi cannons work. The AX multi cannons is doesn't the Goss cannon isn't that one that you have to kind of hold and fire, or is that one? Is that the one that just kind of 
blasts out a little blast. I don't like those. You'd be better off with the multi-cannons. Besides, too, the, the glaives, when you're hitting the glaive, if you run into a glaive. I don't know how well the Goss does against those. Yeah. I don't, yeah. You don't have time to be thinking about if a glaive comes and starts ripping you to shreds, you ain't got time to be worried about all that. Yeah, it's yeah. AX multi cannons. You don't have to. You don't have to time anything. You just start shoot. You just keep. You just hold down the gun. Uh, personally, yeah. I mean, there are things that I don't mind doing a pause for, but that's not it. If you're going to fight the Goids and you run into a glaive, you need to. That glaive needs to be pounded into the sand. And if you if you let it, if you give it a, a delay. He's just going to start electrocuting you and redeal his shield. So you're just better off to keep just punching him. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I'm not a big fan of scout killing. They're no fun. The, the ones that are fun to kill are Cyclops. <laughs> Cyclops are the fun ones. And then, you know, Basilis are okay too. I do okay with Basilis, but the Medusas, I do okay with them. It's just like I'm not... I have not been able to kill a Hydra. Hydras are nasty. Nasty, nasty, nasty. But I wouldn't, if you just, if you're just starting, I wouldn't worry about the T10. I would just get the, get the crate and just go, because you can kill scouts really quick with those AX multi cannons. And like I said, it's not the same kind of fighting as when you're in a, in a uh, regular zone, it's not in a in a in a regular CZ or, or in a extraction site or whatever. Goids fire a lot differently, and they do a lot of stuff, and you got to chase them around. So it's like the less you have to worry about what's going on with your guns, the better. Um, I've tried I've tried some uh, of the uh, not the Gauss cannon, but the plasma guns. Those are nice, but they're just too damn slow. Yeah, I start with I would start with my my recommendation is start with the AX multi cannons. Don't worry about because um, you're gonna on a T10 you're gonna need a bunch of turreted stuff, and and if you don't get AX weapons per se, then you're gonna have to engineer everything. Well, yeah, right. That's the biggest problem I have is I don't want to sit there for three hours trying to kill a Hydra. You can just do it the dino way. Dino just gets the instant started, and then he goes to bed and wakes up in the morning to see if they gave him the credit for killing him. <laughs> tag it, tag it first, then go to bed. I was like, what? what is wrong? I don't even know if he ended up with the... With the uh, if you skip the tutorial, do they have one? I didn't even know they had one. I don't know if you can go back and do it. What do you need a tutorial for? You already know how to fly. Um, I don't know, to be honest, Charles. I never, I never saw a tutorial. I, they, whenever they built that, I wasn't playing the game anymore. When I first started, they just dropped you in the system and said have fun see you later and that was that was my tutorial <coughs> you have to decide too like what kind of uh combat you want to do <coughs> and the only thing that's in question right now is whether or not they're going to continue to let us have station support because station support is a way different animal than just fighting stuff out in space. Oh, you're back at the... It took you like 12 hours. What have you been doing? All right, so... <laughs> just just kidding. I'm smart -ass. Oh, yeah, you know what? Okay, I did get that tutorial. You know what I did? I couldn't figure it out, so I skipped it.
Yeah, you yeah, you basically I can't remember how I got out of it, but there is a way out of it. Or you can just do it. It's not even that long. I don't think it's that long. You just have to like do something on a station. You have to cut some doors open and power some things and then then they let you go. Then you can go back to the station. Are you expecting me to come back over there? Okay. Okay, so you are expecting me to come back over there. All right, I'll try and find you again. Did you already scan the mega? You haven't scanned the mega ship yet? Yeah, I would. Yeah, I'd skip it. You can watch a YouTube video later if you really want to know. <laughs> We'll, we'll go out. We'll go do some together if you want, because I suck on the ground missions. I'm bad. I had Dino and uh, Nachos and uh, Highlander with me one night, and we were doing a bunch of missions. I had no idea what I was doing. They're like, push this, push that. Okay. Oh, yeah. What is he saying? Did he say Klingon? The hell am I disrupting? You are now clear of the station. Safe travels, Commander. I better not get over there and there be a damn another Hydra, man. That thing about scared the pants off me. Oh, yeah, I'm wearing pants too. Yeah, I skipped it. I remember now. I did get that tutorial. <laughs> I couldn't figure it out, man. I was like frustrated in like 30 seconds. I was like, no, I'm not doing this. What do you mean? They were trying to tell me to get out some weird tool and to pick the locks or something, or chop the locks off. Okay, how did I do that last time? I, co I connected to your wake. I like that. Okay, I'm on teammate lab lock. Uh oh, something bigger. Well, I don't care as long as it ain't a hydra. Oh, good, yeah. Are you in the bubble, Charles? How come I can't see you, though? Where's your damn wake? It's not showing me your wake. Is it contacts? No. Oh, is that you? Is that you? That's the star? So if you look at, if you guys ever want to chit chat or whatever, just come down. Uh, you can get on my Discord. Um, trying to find what's a wing beacon? Is it off? stuff man <laughs> oh you got it okay good well you and I still there I think I'm still there I'm in the author room, you know, in the...
Yeah, I, I, I think it's neat, but it's not like totally important to me about the like space legs. I don't think. I think once everybody got there, like, oh, but we wanted to do this instead, you know. And it's like, yeah, that's why they don't want to give us anything. That's why they don't want to make new stuff for us because we say we want this, we want that, and then I remember when uh, Eve Online did the same thing. They got um, they they put in they put in, but all they did was where you can get you can get off of the ship and go into like all they give you is like a little bedroom to go into, and everybody seemed to be okay with that. I don't know why the elite people are so tripped out. Still, I can't even remember what I was doing now. What the hell was I doing? Low wake. I don't need that. Uh, I don't even see you. Are you still in the same instance? If you have an SRV, good. Yeah, you don't need arsenic. You're going to be fine. Most of that stuff now, you don't have to... They made it a lot easier to open the engineers. It's still not fun, but at least you can... A lot of the stuff, like some of the stuff you need that you would have had to have mining for, you can just uh, you can just buy it off of a carrier in a lot of cases now. I don't know. I can't even find them. That's the other one. I don't want that. Yeah, there's no way in hell I'm flying all the way over there. I don't even see that thing anymore. Where's the other one? Where's the other? Are you kidding me right now? Scanner. Wait a minute. Let's see if I can figure out. Where was that? Yeah, it was this one, right? A dash three. Ah, uh, that's okay. Well, I can't figure out how to get find you anyway. It's not letting me do it. Did you scan your ship now? Yeah, I didn't see it. <coughs> I looked at it. <coughs> see? It's not on here. It's not in navigation. It's not anywhere. I don't know where the hell. I check. Wait a minute. Maybe I need to redo that. Yeah, I don't even see you. You're not even on my scanner. You're not on nothing. Yeah, it doesn't show you at all. Yeah, I know. Because I just re redid the... Did you reset your instance? Did you... I've had this problem sometimes. Yeah, Planet 3A, yeah. I remember. He said it was the Ammonia one. That's, that's where I was just looking at 3 <clears throat> or A3.
It shows you on the sun. That's the thing. It shows the the beacon on the sun. Unless you went to a different system. Yeah, because it's not even showing you over there. Hundred and twenty seven light years. I can't be hundred and twenty seven light years. I didn't even go anywhere. Oh, Charles is saying that. Okay, sorry. Oh, I'm ahead of you now? Wait, okay, you just showed up somewhere. Yeah, you just showed up on my list now. Okay, there you are, I see you now. I can cheat you for making that hydra almost get me. <laughs> oh, damn. Okay. No Thargoids detected. Did you get your scan yet? Pretty hot. <clears throat> oh, bummer. No Thargoids detected, so. Look at that little green guy. You need the glowy paint job, man. Look at that glowy. So, yeah, you're not too far. I mean, Charles, if you... Well, I don't have any way to um, board you on my carrier right now. I don't even know if you really want to go... I mean, the only thing I would do for you, Charles, is decide whether or not you want to do, like, rescue missions or if you want to fight the Thargoids because it's different... We can do it a lot more cheaply if you just want to do rescues. And I don't mean money-wise. I mean, well, quicker, too, because... The, um... You don't need... If you don't need guns, then it's a lot cheaper. It just says you interrogated something. I don't know why it told me that, though. I don't even have any missions. Uh oh. Goids are coming. There's a lot of them coming. That's at least three crackles I just heard. Okay, something's out. Two. I heard them, I just don't see them yet. Oh shit, here we go. Next fire group. Next fire group. Next fire group. 
If you insist. Two down. Well, you did something because you got him to come out. Oh, man. Deploy heating. Heating. Deploying now. Not sure what we're doing exactly. Oh, um, yeah, Are you on Windows Eleven. Might need a driver. Besides, I don't have any caustic <clears throat> protection. I don't want to pick nothing up out here. He's interfacing with it again. This is a weird thing. Is this just like we just you can sit here all day and call Thargoids out until the Hydra comes and you run away? No crap. No crap going in my cargo hold, bud. Oh shit. I just got yeeted. It's a bigger one. It's a it's a clops. Only one. Come here, clopsy. Fast enough? Did I, did I kill him fast enough? Power to weapons. Sure. You come out here and pick that crap up, Dino. Weirdo. And all that stuff, you come get it. I got yeeted, man. I was sitting right on the thing where he was getting ready to spawn from. Well, this is kind of sort of fun. Especially if it's Cyclopses. I can sit here and do this all day. I didn't even have powered weapons on yet, and he died. No. No, I don't have a collector limit. How am I getting caustic damage? Oh, is the carcass by me? What am I getting caustic from? The ship? Jesus. Is it the is it the ship? Oh, okay, the corpse was right there. Man, that thing jagged me up. Cost me two two shards. 
two sinks. What are you doing now? You're going to call another one? Doesn't, it looks like you're taking off. <laughs> He's moving. He's moving. Oh, there's an explosion. Oh, we're okay now. I thought that I thought the station was going to explode. Still don't know what we're doing. But, hey, I got a clops. I love me some clops. <laughs> I'm a clops man. I like clops. Well, I haven't ran out of stuff yet. <clears throat> Oh, I see. Well, you can go try it if you want. We can get out of this instance. Near three, yeah, I know that. We're near three, a. okay. Where's the dam? Is it, the, it's not the general hospital, right? No. I should be right next to it. Even with uh, Charles, even with rescue missions, you can make like 20 million in 30 minutes. So if you want to make money faster, that's probably the best way. I can't find the damn thing. Well, because I was following your wake every time. I don't think can't see it now. I don't see whatever it is we're dropping into. Oh yeah, that one. Oh, that one. Okay. I got it now. I couldn't remember where that was. I don't know, whatever you were doing over there was activating something. Oops, went too fast. Got in there anyway. <laughs> okay, I'm in. Data link scanner. I don't even think I had that thing hooked up. Yeah, I don't know what that is. I don't even know what that means. I do pew pew, man. As you can see from that last cycle. <laughs> that poor guy, he didn't know what was coming. Oh damn, a bunch of stuff came mayday, in with mayday. it. We've been attacked by Thargoids. Can anyone help us evacuate Okay, the Thargoids ship? are coming. Thargoids detected. He's 
Coming out over here somewhere. It's uh, scouts. Just one. I knew I was going to get down. Ooh, that was fun. Look at all them parts flying around. Goys detected. Now I don't even know what this is. I don't think he does either. Do I need to? Do I need to join this? Booty Bay Butchers. Evacuate the ship. How are we supposed to do that? Do I need to accept this thing? Says it wants me to help evacuate. I ain't got nothing to evacuate. I'm not that kind of ship. You better get Charles in here. Charles, we need evacuations. <laughs> well, <you're not laughs> well, who knows anything? I don't know. Charles, what's going on here? They're healing up my ship. Nice. That's good. Wish they could give me some more bullets. I'm just not sure if I need to accept this mission because I can't. I can't take any passengers anywhere or, or car. Well, I, I could take a little cargo I, if I launch some of my my thingies out here, but I don't have any caustic cargo hold. Maybe they knew. Maybe the the game pro the game must know that I don't have any way to do anything. Okay, so they got two of eighteen right now. You can only lose five escape pods. That's not a lot. This is kind of a cool event. I didn't know they had... I mean, I've seen other events, but not this one. This is a good one. You need a hatchbreaker? I don't hang I ain't got none of that. I don't think that's on my list. This is a Thargoid ship though. So. 
Yeah, if I knew how to find these things, I'd, I'd do some more of them. not a hydra. I heard him crack one. Where's he at? It's a big one. By your command. Our weapons. Power to weapons. Boy, he's in.
All power to engines. Power to weapons. Using power to weapons. This guy is a mover. That was interesting. Yeah, I'll repair. I'm repairing right now. What are you talking about? There's another collapse coming. Oh shit, it's a Medusa. You ready to take on a Medusa? It's coming for me. Part engines. Next fire group. Next fire group. Stuff to take this one out. Next fire gun. Okay. Next fire gun. Next fire gun. Oh, Fire engines. Unnecessary.
Heat sinks refilled. Well, I don't think we're going to make this mission. The rescuer was killed. Synthesis complete. I got a little bit of heat sink. Peddled him yet? Okay, let's see what we can do. Oh, he's Transcend into the human mind, and with that human form, we just continue. That's what I want. If I want that, I usually find a way to I gotta pull back, can't be on down 5%. Hard engines. Diverting power to requested system. Simply unlucky. Yeah, that's yeah, I was simply unlucky. Should have kept going. I couldn't tell that you were gone though. Well, I didn't I guess I didn't look hard enough. Well, at least I landed at that place. Oh yeah, mine were too. I thought you were still there. That's why I thought you were still there. Because I, I seen the laser. I thought that was you. Shields offline. Okay, well, that was fun. Yeah, I should have kept running. I was running pretty good there for a minute. By the minute I turned around and he was coming, I didn't even realize he was coming for me. So it was too late. I was like, oh boy. That's not going to go well. I'm under 6.8. All right. Well, shit balls. Now what? 
Well, we got to have fun with that. That's a new thing. I've never seen that. Yeah, it was crazy. I knew we were in trouble when that Medusa dropped in there. I was like, God dang. It took a long time to kill the Cyclops. I was like, geez, that guy just doesn't want to die. Oh, well, you got to die. You got to break a few eggs and make an omelet, right? It was a rough day. That's all I can say. Yeah, I better. I'm probably not going to do too many more of those anytime soon. But yeah, it is kind of a fun event, though. It's better for a group. Though. Obviously, well, you know, a full group. Two guys, maybe okay, but not necessarily. Just like I said, there's nowhere to repair. That's where I always get into trouble. I mean, if I could have sat there and repaired for, you know, 20 minutes. But we were going to lose the event anyway because we were already losing pilots. We lost like three of them. We lost a bunch of rescue whatevers. I, I, I don't know. Maybe you need a guy that can rescue the pods or hold on to them or something. Because whatever it was, we didn't have it. Yeah, that was, a, that was an interesting event, though. Mm -mm. Well, boys and girls, I think for as far as the stream goes, that's a pretty amazing ending. We're about four hours in, so I'm going to call it. Got to go feed the kitty cat and stuff like that. So, And I'll just hang out here for a minute. But I'll still be around. Like I said, if you guys want to chit-chat later, call me on the Discord and we'll talk. Okay? Um, till then, thanks for coming out today. Hope all your questions got answered. Oh, it was a bassy. It wasn't a cyclops. Okay. Makes sense. <laughs> it was like, guy took a long time. Um... Yeah. All right. Well, like I said, I'm around on the Discord. The link to the Discord is down below. You can verify yourself. And uh, there's a one of the rooms in there, the hello room or whatever. You can verify yourself if you want to get in on that action. But uh, till next time, my friends, stay safe, commanders.
Greetings, Commander. 